with YouTube. It's been like a two month break. I've been off of YouTube <clears throat> and really all social media. I've been like living a very private life um, the past couple months. I mean, I've been on, I've been on social media. Like I'll post here and there, but um, I have a lot of things going on in my life that I'm really excited about, but I'm not ready to share it yet. So I'm just waiting on the Lord or not like the Lord. I'm just I'm waiting on like when I'm ready to like release. I've been enjoying like the private life, like let like not everybody knowing what I'm doing, not everybody knowing where I'm at or what's going on. <laughs> it's been really nice. But the Lord is funny because I literally just made like an hour. I'm in the car. I'm not driving. I'm sitting in the parking lot um with my camera because I wanted to, I wanted to vlog today and I'm like yes I'm gonna get my have a babysitter. It's Friday. Yay I was gonna like try to create some like content because I am like starting to get the urge to like be create like I'm getting a creative urge in me again so I'm like oh I want to make a video for my YouTube like I miss creating stuff you know like naturally I have a creative spirit the Lord has given me so I like to do stuff like this it brings me joy I like um, you know, beauty, all things beauty, fashion. I'm wearing my Revival Mama Clothes and Grace shirt by Jenny Weaver, my mentor. Um, tonight at 8 p.m., I'm going to my friend Alyssa's house for our core group meetup. I can't believe I've been in the core group for this long. I'll be since July of last year. I've been in, and I've just seen so much fruit. So many good things happened in my life since. But I can't say enough amazing things. I didn't even make this video <laughs> to talk about the core group, but I feel like it like works its way in all my conversations and all my videos, which is obviously great. It's a woman's mentorship group that has like over 10,000 people in it now, and it's it's grown so much more than that since I joined. Like we have a marriage group now that me and my husband are a part of. We have core kids right now. We have literally core farms. Like we are literally going to the nations with the core group. So which we already have, there's like 10,000 people. We're all from all over. So we meet once a month, and I used to be a host, but the Lord actually told me to take a break from hosting in this season, so I'm gonna be going to my friend's house and just worshiping and praying and just fellowship and like unity with other women of God, which I really need this, right? Like I really need this because last two months have been so busy and chaotic and just like I need like to be still and I just need fellowship with other women who are for me who love me who are gonna pray for me and yes I'm excited anyways I get so off topic um like I was saying I was gonna make a vlog today because I, I was being creative and it's Friday and I have a babysitter on Fridays um if you watch any of my other videos, you know that I'm a stay-at-home mom to four children and a stepmom to one of them. And um, on Fridays, it's like my those are my days I get to go out and <laughs> run my errands, get my smoothie, grocery shop, and whatnot. And I I just thought it'd be a good opportunity to do some vlogging. And then I'm such, I'm so bad at this because I'll bring my cam I always have my camera. Like I have my camera with me and my purse and my tripod. I just forget to freaking set it up and like record what I'm doing. And so I'm like, oh, I just like missed my whole morning already. Went to Tropical Smoothie, got my Refix. And I'm debating if I want to go to Target. I'm really trying to be financially like, that's the right word responsible and not spend all my money like I'm really trying to be like conservative and only buy things I like absolutely need or like you know give myself a budget because it's just something the Lord wants me to do so I'm like well I can go shopping like I don't want to go home yet like my son's at school he goes to the ads this weekend I'm like what am I gonna do I can get on I can start I can make a video so here I am I just wanted to pop on and say hi I'll probably add some stuff to this video maybe I'll turn it into a vlog maybe not maybe I'm just popping in to say hi I'm back I'm alive I'm doing amazing and um, I don't have any like announcements that I'm ready to share yet but next month 
stay tuned because I will have a huge announcement. Um, but in April, my husband and I are going actually to the core retreat. It's all I can talk about. <laughs> the core group. We're gonna be there. It's called in the um, the retreat's name is called the Rise of the Debras. And there's gonna be 3,000 of us there, and I am like, so expectant and like just so excited for what the Lord's gonna do. He's already done such a great, like, amazing like work in us since joining this group and the marriage group. There's gonna be a testimony video coming soon. <laughs> I like feel it brewing in this. I feel the Lord like nudging us to like make videos together and to share our testimony because. How do you overcome the enemy you know, by the blood, the blood of the lamb and the word of your cut testimony? Like somebody needs to hear it like this. Like somebody, somebody's gonna be set free from our story, and um, that's a video that's gonna be coming really soon uh, once once we pray on it and get ready for it. But I'm gonna probably run into the mall. I guess I know I said I'm not gonna shop. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look around because I am. I do need like a couple things, so. I, I'm gonna buy what I need <laughs> and then um yeah I'll share a little bit of the rest of my day thank you for hopping on here today I want to encourage somebody to say God loves you and he's for you and um if he's for you who can be against you so don't worry keep following the Lord keep pressing in don't lose hope don't give up <clears throat> oh my gosh all these like ducks are coming or those are geese actually I think they're geese they're like coming to my car right now oh my gosh they're like surrounding my car I'm not an animal person I don't do animals <laughs> oh all right love you guys okay the lighting in my bathroom honestly is terrible because I have a window right here and I usually get ready right here but when I try to film right here it the lighting is just horrible and I also have a window over here so just bear with me also, I am so pale. I have never been this pale in my life. It's honestly really depressing, but it is what it is. I lost my self tanner. Here it is. I bought a new self tanner at Target the other day, um, and I can't find it anywhere. So I'm just gonna be pale. I live in Ohio, and it's freezing cold outside, and. There's no sign like ever. So, it is what it is. Can't do anything about it. I just washed my face and took my makeup off. And I'm just gonna apply my makeup really quick because I'm about to go to my son's basketball game. He uh, He's so cute. He asked me to film it with my camera. So I'm going to bring my tripod, I'm going to film him, I'm going to try and get him, I don't know, I'm not good at doing that, but I'm going to try it for him. Um, so this is just like the e.l.f. What is it, super tone toner I'm using. I just, I ran out of my skin my skincare and I'm using a, um, just what I have on me, but this isn't like what my typical skincare routine. I'm actually gonna be trying a new product line soon. Um, it should be here Thursday, but this is a Tula um, skincare serum brightening treatment drops. So um, I don't love it, but I'm just using it. I haven't really been taking care of my skin how I should be because I've been so so sick I've kind of neglected a lot of self-care but I am getting back to it this is my um, jade roller and my I don't even know how to pronounce this but and I don't know if I'm doing this right I just I'm trying to depuff my face. So I'm probably gonna add this video to my last um, video I made because it's been so long since 
I've uploaded a video and I feel like I never finish them. Like I'll start a vlog and I never finish it. Like I just get so busy or I my camera dies. Something always happens, but I'm trying to be better with that. Now I need to put like a serum on. Again, this isn't my typical like skincare routine. I'm just using stuff that I bought that I have. I don't love any of these products. Like I wouldn't rec. It's not like I'm like here. This is not what I would typically use. It's just what I have. These products don't work the best for my skin type. I'm just using what I have. So this is just like Clinique, dramatically different moisturizer. I really wanted to love this product. It just really didn't do much for my skin. I didn't really see that much of an improvement, to be honest. I'm just using it because, again, it's all I have. I'm gonna go in with this. I don't really know if these things actually work or if it's just like a gimmick, but I think they do help with like lymphatic drainage. Like right here, when you press down, and it also helps like with your jawbone, like sculpt look i don't know how long it lasts it'll look good right after i do it but i don't know how long <laughs> pretty sure you have to do this like every day for like 10 minutes a day and i just am not that committed to self-care at the moment as you can my place clearly you can tell i've been like breaking out a lot hormones are imbalance stress motherhood <laughs> all of the above but I'm showing up today, you know, regardless, I'm going to come out here and make this video and we're going to go to the mall after um, Luca's basketball game. I'm taking my daughters and her, their friend to the mall, to the playground so they can play for a little bit to get out of the house because we've been in the house the past couple days <clears throat> um i do love these actually this is arbonne um these are my oh they're like i haven't used them as often they're like, like much better they're my eye gel pads that i love but i'm very bad at like consistently using them again i i don't know self-care it just has not been my priority lately and I'm trying to get back to it because I'm like I'm sick of feeling like crap all the time I'm like I need to get back to like taking care of my health and my body and my skin and I just bought some more Modier supplements I still take them and I love them um, I bought the trim which is like a fat burning supplement so i just bought that and then i i take um i take collagen every day from them too which is okay that's it broke but it's it'll get the job done <laughs> you know it's fine they say that these like work better if you put them in the fridge because they help like with de-puffing but I feel like when I put them in the fridge, I forget about them, so they're pretty cold. My bathroom's pretty cold because I have two windows, but okay. I hope my camera doesn't die because it's like my luck. Every time I go to film a video, my camera dies like in the middle of me making the video. I need to buy a second battery, which maybe I'll do that today. I'll go buy a second battery. Okay, so we're going to keep those on while I do my eye makeup. I'm just going to put them down a little bit. But my face is all clean, finally. Um, same thing with my makeup. This isn't makeup that I love. <laughs> it's really just like cheap drug mart makeup. I am trying a new product company. I said I'll be here Thursday. Um, I'll share details of the company when i get it i don't want to speak too soon because i i want to do like a live um of me live recording of me trying the 
products to see how I think about them and like how they wear throughout the day and all that good stuff. So I'm just doing my makeup, nothing special. This isn't like going to be like a tutorial or I mean obviously you're watching me so you can see what I'm doing like I'm just prepping my eyes but I'm really just focusing on like a quick face to get me out the door so I can make it to my son's basketball game in time okay my camera is about to die I'm so done I'm done with this I'm literally done with this so maybe I'll just do my makeup and then I will just record the rest when, um, when it charges, so we'll see. I do like this palette though. I've had this palette for years. It's like my favorite. It's like the Tarte Cosmetics um, Clay Pay. Like it's like an all-in-one face palette. So it's like eyebrows, um, bronzer, contour. Like these are my colors that I use like every single day. So I'm just going in with like the the lighter shades to do some eyeshadow. Um, and what I like about these like um, gel pads is that you can use them for like eyeshadow markers. Like where to stop your eyeshadow at. But yeah, at least I have a charger here. I don't know why my camera battery dies so fast. It's really annoying. I have the Canon G G7. I just got it for me last year, last Valentine's Day, and oh, I absolutely love it. It's great for vlogging. It's great for content I'm making. It has like great reviews. It's kind of pricey, but it was worth it. And I bought like the tripod that goes with it, and I have a like case too, which is actually right here. <laughs> Like you can switch, you can buy different cases for it. So this is like a beige one. It's when I can't use it when it's on the tripod. So it sucks I have to take it off when I'm, it's on the tripod because it gets all like smushed together. But it's like this uh, silicone case. I got it on Amazon for like seven bucks. I'm about to buy a pink one. Because I saw they have, they have pink and it's like super cute. But I'm a neutral type of person. Like my house is neutral my closet is mostly neutral i just don't like a lot of color i guess in my life it's so therapeutic doing your makeup after like not doing it for like a month and then you finally get to do it again it's something just is so therapeutic about getting yourself together after looking homeless for a long time, which is how I have been feeling the last couple weeks, which in my next video that I'm going to make, you'll find out why I've been sick for so long and um, it would all make sense. We just have to wait until then because I'm not ready to announce it. I'm the worst at like keeping secrets. I mean, I can keep a secret from like, it's like personal, like from somebody, like I can keep those types of secrets, but stuff that I'm like excited about, like I just want to tell everybody, like stuff that, that's like, I don't know, like big and exciting, like surprises, you know, like stuff like that. I'm like, oh my gosh, I want, I want, I'm so excited. Like I can't like stop. But when it comes to like people's um like dark secrets, I'm good at keeping those look. Cause I feel like that's nobody's business too. Anyways, but I just wish I could like change my bathroom layout and like put all of this over here and move all this, like move the shower and the mirror on the other side because it would make my life so much easier and I wouldn't have to sit on the ground to film videos, but yeah. Okay, I saw this trick on TikTok and it's like, 
to like <laughs> expand your corner so i'm gonna try it i just took a dark brown with an angled brush like this and you just kind of put it on the corner like right here and make like a small v I bet my kids are destroying this like that and then you take it really close to your lash line underneath like this I didn't really do a good job of that but that's kind of what it looks like it's easier if you like wet the brush but I don't feel like doing that My eyes are kind of burning from my makeup remover. Um, I was using the e.l.f. cosmetics, which I don't like that makeup remover. It literally burns the crap out of my eyes. And I'm currently out of dry shampoo makeup remover. So I really need to restock. I've been using brown liner for a long time. I just, it's liquid still. This is by Too Faced. The top of it's kind of messed up, so I'm like, I don't know how good it's gonna apply. I don't know if you can like see like the top. It's very like janky, but I'm gonna try and see if I can get it to work. That's not bad. I just want to do like a small little, a little bit of liner. I've been like doing less liner recently or just mascara on my eyes and like no sh shadow. But I just wanted to go for, I said I was doing a quick face and here I am like doing a whole. Hey, go play. Um, be nice. You need to be nice, okay? Fiona. Fiona, did you go potty? I don't want to go potty, but I will go potty. Okay, well, are you being nice to your friends? Yeah. Okay, what are you and Vera doing? Okay, I finished my makeup. My camera died, of course. So I need to go buy a new battery. Um, it took me a half hour to find an outfit because none of my clothes fit me. And I ended up finding my spray tan that I bought, but I haven't used it yet because I'm afraid it's going to make me turn orange. It's the L'Oreal Paris <clears throat> Sublime Bronze. I've never used this before. I bought it really quick. Um, it's like an airbrush one, which I'm excited to use. Um, I don't know how, it's, I don't know anything about it. I never used it, but I bought it really quick, um, at Target when I got my toner in. I feel like my lash just comes off. Um, anywho, I haven't used it yet because I'm afraid it's going to make me turn orange because the typical tanning, um, lotion I use is like a foam base and it's from Coco and Eve and I absolutely love it. I get the shade dark because I have like olive skin tone. I'm like naturally pretty like tan. Um, I have like a yellow olive undertone so it's hard to find something that doesn't make me turn orange. So I'm hoping that works but I'm about to get the girls ready and we're all <clears throat> gonna head out the door shortly and go see my son play by his basketball game then we're gonna go to the mall 
and probably Best Buy to go buy this battery. So, yes, and I need dry shampoo. Like, I can't live without dry shampoo, and my hair is so oily. I don't have any, so it's just gonna be an oily hair day, unless I put my hat on, but. <laughs> I don't want to be that mom that's like super, I'm already like really like dressed up. I just have leggings, like leggings on, but I feel like I'm overly dressed up for a basketball game. But literally I had nothing to wear. Like no, nothing fits me. So um, I had to improvise. This is what we got. But here's a close up of my makeup. My skin isn't that great, but I'm not worried about it. This eyelash just keeps popping off. It's like really aggravating. Hoping it will stay on <clears throat> throughout today, but whatever. Okay, we made it in the car, but I'm super late because it takes so long getting all the kids in the car. So we're gonna miss his game, and I feel so bad, but it's okay because he's got more. He's with his he's with his dad this weekend anyway, so I just asked him to send me videos of it. And I can share so we're just going straight to the mall to play and eat because there's no way that I'm gonna make it there in time because it's just if you're a mom and you know this it takes so long getting the kids in the car and my daughter had could not find her shoes so it was a nightmare and I'm also filming on the iPhone now because which is fine I have the iPhone 14 it's like good quality but um because camera battery is gonna die again and it's harder to use the camera in the car or like anywhere else I'm not driving yet so um yeah we're heading off to the mall <laughs>